Since I still don't have lanterns yet, might as well just fight in that area that I fought before. Now, unfortunately, I don't have, like, tools to sell to the trader. I'm thinking after this, what I'm going to do is start harvesting some, uh... What was it called? The bismuth? So I can start making bismuth lanterns. Like, we have a lot of bismuth in this area. And a lot of copper as well, but I can't make the bismuth bronze without zinc. And I do have... Wait. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's make one more. I, I just don't have a deposit for zinc yet. Or an area where we can get lots of zinc. So we can't make the bismuth bronze, but we do have lots of bismuth by itself. Oh, we have six bandages now. And I probably should get some of the... Probably should cook some vegetables before I go. If I have time... Just so we can get some more of that going. And what did I leave in here? Oh, it's the linen bags. Yeah, so probably should, like, put some vegetables on. Which is a nice vegetable stew. And then, this will be done once I get back. I should also get a full stack of torches. I need to put those down. Oh yeah, I also need to make some charcoal. And I need to continue mining out a quarry. Just so I can get the building materials. Oh, we should eat this now. Get the meat stew, and then this is all done, so I'll just keep that in my inventory. Put the copper lantern in here. Alright, here we go, another temporal storm. This time it's medium. And we got our cloth armor, Gambeson. And we still have our copper helmet and copper leg armor. I don't think I need to put down some torches when I get to that area, but... Oh, it's already 2 o'clock, so it's gonna be dark by the time I get there, so... Put down a few torches. Make sure we maintain vision the entire time. I definitely don't want to be fighting here because we do have wolves in this area that I never took out yet. Oh yeah, I'm also going to need more medical supplies. Those bandages were something that I never knew was added to the game. But it looks like it needs alcohol. I'm gonna need to like... Make some of that stuff in order to do that, except I can't. At least I don't think we'll be able to make that in a year. Like I'm only playing for one year in this playthrough, so keep that in mind. I probably don't have time to like do that. Don't even have enough time to make cheese either. So, when it comes to the milk, I'm probably just gonna drink it all. Drink as much as possible, because I'm not gonna be losing the, losing the nutrition anyway from death, because I'm not going to die. Okay, 
Okay, I'm surprised I haven't seen any drifters yet. So like they're not coming out to play. Wait, do I have anything I can give the trader? Okay, so I still have Bismuth Bronze and Tin Bronze Pickaxe, so... After this temporal storm, gonna check out the trader, see if I can sell anything to him. Oh, that's a hole. Ah, here's the drifter. So this is the area that I was fighting in before. Wait, is it raining? Am I hearing rain right now? If I'm hearing rain, I'm gonna be pissed off if it puts out my torches. Oh, here we go. Double-headed drifter. Come get some. I'm gonna take you out. There we go. Burn through all of my spears to get that guy. And I just need to lead you guys away from him. And then we can harvest you. Double-headed drifter is pretty much guaranteed to have like a temporal gear, yeah. And some gears. Like, we needed that. Okay, it's time to eat again. And they're like throwing rocks at me now. Okay, so we need to get our meat. Oh, come on. Get the meat. Oh, come on. I'm trying to put the meat in this thing here. There we go. I'm gonna need that. Should also put some torches up in this area over here. Oh, come on. Yeah, it was raining in this area, so that put out the torches. There's nothing here. They are all dead. Alright, rusty gear. Making a decent amount of money here. Even though most of it was from that double-headed drifter. Okay, we're still clear. Nothing. Oh shit, I heard that. Yeah, you spawned like really close to me. Oh shit. I'm gonna throw a rock at me. Oh jeez. Even got a surface drifter. Did you? Wait, you died from a rock. Yeah, the rain around here is putting out the torches. Or flax. I think one of you is a nightmare. Oh, shit! That was close. Yeah, you're a nightmare drifter. And I am liking these multi hits. Oh, 
Yeah, you're pelting me with rocks. Okay, can't take you yet. It's getting hard to see because of the rain. Like, it rarely rains here and it's raining. So, I don't like that. Like, I specifically came here because I wanted to avoid the rain. And it's raining. Oh, here we go. I'm killing a lot of these drifters now, but I can't harvest them. Uh Really is hard to see. Can't carve you guys. There we go. Got one carved. Need my spears back. There we go. Alright, let's carve you guys up while we still can. Alright, another rusty gear. Flax. Oh shit. Okay, I can get you. Oh, fuck! Jesus Christ! What the fuck? Oh. Oh my god, I got hit by a nightmare drifter. Oh, fuck, we have to evade. Oh no. It's like a nightmare drifter hit my leg. Now my armor's gone. I think there was like half durability there still. Oh, we're in a bushy area. Oh, that was painful. That could have ended the playthrough right there. So keep that in mind. Rusty gear. Need to try and like stay near the light. Because it is very difficult to see around here. Maybe I'll put down like more torches. I'm out of healing items. If I get hit by a Nightmare Drifter again, like, th that's pretty much game over. Like, damn, I can't believe that happened. Oh! <laughs> Temporal Storm is waning. You know what, fuck it. Just run around. Oh my god. That was so close. That was such huge damage. But I survived it. Like, I need to top off my vegetable nutrition. Because that could have ended poorly. Just like one hit. You know what? I'm also going to check the resin over here. Try to evade these drifters while I still can. There we go, we're done. Leaky pine still hasn't respawned. It still hasn't respawned. Okay. 
So that is it. That is the end of this temporal storm. And they should have despawned by now. Rift activity. Oh! What? This thing had leaky pine. Like this thing right here. Oh, you're still coming after me. Okay, maybe I do need to take you out after all. There we go. Like, damn. Okay, there's my flax. Okay, I'm gonna have to go after more horsetail. Alright, let's take these pickaxes. Let's see what we can sell. I can't, can't believe there was leaky pine like right here. Like if I was looking at that tree, I would have seen it. Anyway. That's it for the temporal storm. Let's get back to work. Goods in one day. Uh, we can't sell you anything else. Oh well, let's just bring this back over to... Bring all this stuff back to uh, base here. I'm just gonna continue leaving this pickaxe here. And I'm just gonna leave the torches there, fuck it. And we do have 10 gears, so... Let's go buy stuff from the commodities trader. If there's more black powder there, I'm gonna buy that. We need to make some more bombs. If the resin hasn't respawned back at that treasure hunter, then most likely this area up ahead, the resin hasn't respawned either. I'm just not going to bother with that. Alright, it's about to be September 6th. They probably should get like one more round of hunting in. Oh yeah, I should also check on the leather, see if we have that ready, because I need to get that last backpack in, just to get that last inventory slot. Oh yeah, I probably should start working on the charcoal pit next. Need to get more of that going. Everything's turning red now. All of these have matured. Need to get some sticks going as well. Oh, these are still going. And I'm gonna have to make some feet armor or feet armor, what? This is still going. You know what? I'm just gonna leave that like so. And then here's all of my gears, here's all my temporal gears. We have nine of them.
All right, so I can get zinc now and blasting powder. Uh, what should I get? You know, more blasting powder. Or, oh, you only have three supply. And then we can do... Well, let's get some zinc here. Just so we can start getting some more bismuth. Okay, we have a lot of bismuth. We have... This is all of our zinc? Or where is it? Yes, yeah, only 20 nuggets worth of zinc. We need to harvest more copper. So... Uh, what should I do first though? It's like I'm trying to decide on what should I, I should be doing. Wait a minute. This is done. Okay, let's eat this. Alright, so let's put our green spears up here. We'll just save it for later. and six and then we'll just seven yeah eight so we just keep these two spears in our inventory oh and before I go we'll take the glass from here we need to make some windows That's it. So we should go down into the cave, get some more copper, get some more quartz. Just gonna transfer this stuff over here. It's over here. It's one. No, oh, it's over here. We move this stuff to this chest over here. Oh, I do need to transfer these to like the cellar. Okay, so how do we make our feet? Leg armor. Okay, so it goes like this. And then the flax twine here and here. And that is our leg armor. What? Leg armor goes... Yeah, why didn't you like, go in there before? That is just so weird. Well, anyway. Oh, I can Might as well transfer these grains... Uh, up top because we're gonna use that to feed our animals and then we'll put These vegetables in here So yeah, that works Then we will have our saw we're gonna Turn this into half slabs we're gonna use that for our windows I might as well go up here. Fill up these things. Just top off everything. And there we go. So put our grains in here. 
Just so it's close by and we can feed them. And there's some extra blasting powder here. Oh yeah, that's what I came here for. So rye grains will transfer downstairs. We need to do something with that silver as well. So I came here for bombs here. Okay, we can make one more. Like, didn't we have like more bombs somewhere? I feel like we did and I lost track of it. I don't know why it would be in there, but I'm checking anyway. Yeah, so let's check our inventory. So we have eight, nine uh, red meat stew with vegetables. We have three crocs of white currant jam, three, four crocs of black currant jam. We have six crocs of red currant jelly. I don't know why it's called jelly. It should be jam. But anyway, we have four, five crocs of blueberry jam. I think we're pretty much set for the winter time, but I do want a little bit more food. And there is something in my hot bar there for flax. Yeah, it's like, where did I put the rest of my bombs? Like... I really do need to organize my inventory because I should have more than I already... Oh, these things. And I have gears here as well, as well as another temporal gear. Oh yeah, here's my bombs. So I have 31 bombs in total and I have three more resin in here. Put this in here. I need to put these vegetables down into the cellar. Like, it's fresh for 5.5 .5 days. Then put it down here, it's fresh for 28. I left it out there for too long. Anyway. So, right now, what I'm going to do is start chopping down trees. Like, we need firewood. Gonna start with these trees that I need to chop down. Also need sticks. Also makes it easier to chop down the tree if I do it like this. And I get the sticks as well. Okay, we'll chop this down. And this thing gives us lots of oak. Oh, that is a lot of oak. Oh shit! That was a drifter. Damn, dude. Caught me by surprise. But if there... There can't be just one of you. Like, that was freaky. It's like he came up to me from like behind, not saying anything. <laughs> 